Hi friends, did you look outside today? It's snowing, the first snow of the year. So I thought we would read the book, The Snowy Day by Ezra Jack Keats. This is one of Miss Sarah's favorites. One winter morning, Peter woke up and looked out the window. Snow had fallen during the night. It covered everything as far as he could see. Does it look like that outside your window right now? After breakfast, he put on his snowsuit and ran outside. The snow was piled up very high along the street to make a path for walking. Crunch, 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 his feet sank into the snow. He walked with his toes pointing out like this. He walked with his toes pointing out like that. Then he dragged his feet slowly to make tracks and he found something sticking out of the snow that made a new track. It was a stick, a stick that was just right for smacking a snow covered tree. What do you think is going to happen when he smacks that snow on the tree? Down fell the snow, plop, on top of Peter's head. He thought it would be fun to join the big boys in their snowball fight, but he knew he wasn't old enough, not yet. So he made a smiling snowman and he made angels. He pretended he was a mountain climber. He climbed up a great big tall heaping mountain of snow and slid all the way down. He picked up a handful of snow and another and still another. He packed it round and firm and put the snowball in his pocket for tomorrow. Then he went into his warm house. What do you think's going to happen to the snowball if he took it inside where it's warm? He told his mother all about his adventures while she took off his wet socks. And he thought and thought and thought about them. Before he got into bed, he looked in his pocket. His pocket was empty. The snowball wasn't there. He felt very sad happened to the snowball? Could get melted. While he slept, he dreamed that the sun had melted all the snow away. But when he woke up, his dream was gone. The snow was still everywhere. New snow was falling. After breakfast, he called to his friend from across the hall, and they went out together into the deep, deep snow. The end. All right, my friends, I hope you enjoyed that book. If you would like, I would love if you guys would want to make your own snowy day. You could draw a picture. You could make your own book about a snowy day. Whatever you like. All right, bye.